I just got back from uh, helping out at my mother-in-law's house doing some painting and look at what I have here. It's a box from TKL Knives. Now the cool thing and an exciting thing is that I ordered one knife from TKL, but it, it kind of feels like there's more than that in here. So um, how nice would that be? Official painting knife. Uh, this is the Endura from Spider Coat. Let us, oh, man alive. I think he either made a mistake or he sent me an extra knife. Wow. All right, very cool. Very excited. They come in these cool plastic boxes. Uh, I guess I won't look at the receipt because I don't want to see. He said, a final prototype of the AEBL Night Stalker wearing the Warrior Grips fell in your shipment. They will be available at Blade for the first time ever. Thank you for your business. It's an honor, brother. How cool. All right, let's see. Let's see what we got in here. And then also, oh, sweet. A t-shirt. Let's see, what does this say? Built for life, ready for combat. TKL knives, how cool. Very excited about that. Thank you so much, Tim. I will wear this proudly all about town and let them know. All right, so I will try this one first. See what, oh, hang on, there we go. Okay, so this is not the one I ordered, so we're gonna look at that one second. This is the one, uh, this is the combatant, oh man. And there is a special um, clip that he worked on with um, Discrete Carry Concepts there that I'm gonna, oh, look at this. I love that beautiful G10, that's wood grain G10. Shouldn't be touching it with these filthy hands, but, oh, wow. Oh, that's a great little knife, a knife junkie. Oh my God, that feels so good in hand. That is so locked in. And it's just enough for a four finger grip. Sharp as the Dickens, 80 CRV. Beautiful, I love the, the handle. It just, man, these two finger wells here, it just really grips your hand. And then the whole, whole big thing about TKL knives is how thin he makes the sheaths. Um, so this sheath is about an inch and a half. Now I gotta get this dried paint off here. About an inch and a half. So it's about the width of your of your belt, and it's set up for for uh, scout carry and man. Oh, I'm so excited! I am so excited. The TKL combatant. TKL knives. Wow, that feels good in hand. It just locks right in. That is a little blade. I'm gonna measure it real quick before I open up this other one, which also looks amazing. Let's see. Three and a quarter, three and a quarter inches. Man, that is a beautiful knife. Now from, there are a couple of changes he made from the original one, took some of the belly out, added a swedge, made it a little more stabby. And uh, there you have it. Okay, so now let's open up this second one that he just sent along a prototype. How cool is that? Man, I really appreciate that. Again, in one of these cool boxes. Great, great boxes, great fit. And then get out of here. Get out of here. Oh my God. Oh, this is so sweet. This is the Night Stalker. Is that what is that what that is? Yes, the Night Stalker with the Warrior grips. Wow, uh, that ring is great. That ring is located in the perfect spot. Doesn't take your your fingers out of alignment. And I have medium sized hands. Fits my hand great. Uh, probably in standard grip with ringed knives. I always have my hand outside the ring, my finger outside the ring, it makes a great pommel. That big, that circle there. Wow, this is beautiful. These things are screaming sharp. Nice swedge. Let's see. 
This is AEBL, three and a half inch blade. These things are perfectly sized for um, discreet carry, for, for concealed carry. Oh man. All right, so here they are. Two TKL knives. This is the Combatant and this is the Night Stalker. Thank you so much, Tim, for sending this Night Stalker. And thank you for just building these beautiful knives. I really, man, I love them. I think I'll take this one out for a drive since it's the one I've been waiting for. Ah, oh, love it. This, this Combatant is the perfect size. Sorry for the dirty hands. Thanks for watching.